Did an Israeli soldier in Gaza use the bathroom while standing on an Islamic prayer mat? One of my viewers sent me this video. Now I'm pretty sure this is an Islamic prayer mat. You see this little design right here that comes to a point? That's called the Meharab. It kind of represents the door to a mosque. It's a common prayer mat design. Now, no Muslim would ever pray in the bathroom, nor would they keep their prayer mat in an unclean place like a bathroom. So it's pretty obvious to me that this prayer mat was brought into the bathroom. Now, there is some guidance on this from the Prophet's father-in-law, Omar ibn al-Khattab. There was a tree under which the Prophet's followers agreed to avenge the death of an envoy. It's a long story, but Omar ibn al-Khattab ordered the tree to be cut down when he found out that people were going there to pray. The idea is that things don't really carry sanctity or divinity. So if the prayer mat doesn't have any Quranic writing on it, it's just a piece of cloth. The problem is that non-Muslims are going to look at this and they're going to think that some great crime was committed when really the soldier was just being a jerk. When you're wearing that uniform, you represent your country. Be aware how optics can be used against you.